Hey, what's up Chemical Guys family and welcome to your full step-by-step -step guide on every single one of our compounds and polishes and hybrid products as well. So today we're gonna to be breaking down everything that you guys need to know about which one of these products is gonna be the best one suited for your ride. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the first product that we're gonna start off with is actually, we'll start in a different order. So we're actually gonna start off with VSS. Now VSS is a one-step correction. What does that mean exactly? Well, a one-step correction is kind of doing a bare minimal in terms of paint correction. And when I say paint correction, what I mean by that is removing scratches, swirls, water spots, oxidation, and anything that's on your paintwork that's causing it not to have its full shine and luster. So VSS is a very, very quick and easy to use product. If you're short on time or maybe your business and your customer isn't necessarily wanting to pay for a full thorough paint correction. So VSS is the perfect one-step product to remove virtually most light scratches, imperfections like scratches and swirls in a single one-step product. Now this product, it cuts as a compound and it finishes as a polish. So as you're working on the surface, it goes from a compound, it breaks down to a polish, and then you start refining. You can use this with an orange pad, like a cutting pad or a white pad, depending on the level of imperfections on your paintwork. Now, what happens if your paint is a little bit more neglected and you need to go with a two-step combo? That's when you can go with something like C4, and P4. Now C4 is our clear cut correction compound. That is a great, you can use it as a one step combo as well. However, I would definitely pair it with our P4 polish because whenever it comes to cutting, you always wanna make sure to come back real fine. And that's the beauty about C4 is that it cuts great, it cuts uh, light to moderate to even sometimes heavy scratches depending on which kind of pad that you pair it with and the machine that you use it with. And then obviously whenever you do a cut, you wanna go ahead and refine. So that's when you go ahead and follow it up with P4, which is our precision paint perfection polish. This is more of a jeweling polish. So if you have a beautiful uh, garage queen that you know barely gets driven around, but you like taking care of it, you like polishing it, you're looking for something that has virtually very to little no cut, P4 polish is gonna be a great product to go with because it has a very minimal cut to remove light imperfections. But like I said, if you need to go heavier, go with C4 and then follow with P4. If you don't need to go with C4, just go uh, stick with P4. All right, so what happens whenever you're working on a vehicle that's extremely neglected? I'm talking about it's a 1990 or 1980, it's super oxidized, has uh, very heavy imperfections like scratches and swirls, water spots, then that's where you can go with a multi-step correction system like the Chemical Guys V-Line. Now you have four products right here, both, uh, two of these are compounds and two of these are polishes. Now the reason that we have this thorough line of uh, compounds and polishes is simply because all paints are different, all colors are different, different makes and models, all, uh, dealers, they all use different types of clear coat. So it's gonna vary depending on the kind of vehicle that you have and what you're really going for, which is gonna determine which one of these is gonna be perfect for your ride. So for example, if you have an extremely neglected vehicle, very old, has never been polished or uh, compounded or anything like that, that's when you go with V32. Now V32 is a very great product because it's a very gritty product. So if you actually kind of grab it and you kind of just feel it, I try to pull it into the mic, maybe you guys can hear it. It's extremely gritty, that's not just my fingers, it's actually gritty. So the product, it has a cut to it. So that's why it's labeled as our extreme compound. So like I mentioned, this is when you have to go to the extreme measures of going with a deep cut. Now keep in mind, this is gonna work out great on all kinds of paintwork, whether it's old, whether it's new, but you never wanna have to resort to that as your first option simply because what happens if you have a brand new car with light imperfections? Sure, this will do the job of removing them, but you are gonna be asking and you are gonna be removing a lot more clear coat that you, than you want to. So whenever you compound, whenever you polish, you have to keep in mind that whenever you do so, you're refining down your clear coat very down. All right, so before we were so rudely interrupted, I was talking about V32 and how it does an incredible job at removing imperfections. But keep in mind, whenever you remove imperfections, you're also wearing down your clear coat to a certain extent. So it's not the best idea to always resort to an extreme cutting compound like V32 every single time that you wanna remove imperfections like scratches and swells from your ride. That's why we have lighter options like our P4 polish and or even like some of the rest of our V-line, which I should probably be getting into right now. So V32, extreme v34 is a hybrid grade compound so this is a great product to go with 
if your vehicle has more moderate to heavy imperfections, maybe you don't want to go as aggressive, but you still want to have a nice little bite to it. V34 is a great hybrid compound. It's going to cut like a compound and cut very finely as like a kind of a kind of getting to that stage where you start polishing. So it kind of leaves it in that in-between gap. So V34 is a great product to go with as well. And then obviously you have your polishes. So you have V36, which is a light cutting polish and V38, which is a final polish. Now V36 is great to go with for cutting light imperfections, light swirl marks, water spots, oxidation, and one step solution. So um, before we came out with their C4P4 combination, for the longest we were using products like V36 paired with one of our orange cutting pads as a one-step combination for removing most light to moderate imperfections. But if you want to go ahead and refine it, then that's when you go ahead and follow it up with the product like V38, which has virtually no cut at all, but this is more so designed to bring out the shine, bring out the clarity, refine the finish, and just really bring out the shine from your paintwork. So if you have a vehicle that you don't really want to cut anything, but you want to just bring out that nice deep glow, V38 is going to be the perfect polish to go with. And you can also pair that with a softer white polishing pad or even like any kind of finishing pad that we offer as well. So that's why we have a multi-step correction system like our V-Line because all paints are different. And if you guys are doing any kind of wet sanding for all you uh, body shop guys out there, V32 can remove imperfections from 1200 to 1500 grit. V34 goes from 1500 to 2000 grit. V36 is 2000 to 2500 grit. And then obviously V38 is gonna be 2500 to 3000 grit. So that's a great combination to go with if you're doing any kind of wet sanding. But if not, then you're still gonna be in great terms with your paint. So that has been our Chemical Guys V-Line. Like I said, this is a multi-step correction system. C4P4, a two-step correction system. And then obviously you have VSS, which is a one-step correction system. Now we're gonna move on to a little bit of a different product. We have right here our V4 all-in-one polish and sealant. Now this product specifically is great for the garage queens once again. So if you have a vehicle that you maintain it very often, you take care of it pretty well, you have very to no scratches or swirls or imperfections in your paintwork. So VO4 is gonna do an incredible job at just giving your paint that nice little touch at the end, just to give it a nice little final shine. And it also has that built-in sealant in there for that durable shine and protection. Now moving on, for all you guys out there who have, yep, yeah, that's the one. For all you guys out there who have fiberglass, I'm talking about for you guys out there who have jet skis, RVs, trailers, uh, maybe you have some custom uh, fiberglass parts on your vehicle, Phase 5 fiberglass polish is going to do an incredible job at kind of acting as a hybrid grade product. So what this product does is it cuts as a compound and it refines as a polish specifically for fiberglass surfaces. So the difference between that and paintwork obviously is that fiberglass is easily subjected to those harsh UV rays. So with fiberglass you get a very, very nasty oxidation on trailers. Uh, you know, you name it, they, they absorb all those harsh UV rays and, you know, you need something specifically for that material in order to cut through all the scratches, the swirls, and mainly that oxidation that builds up on that fiberglass. So this is going to be a great one-step solution. You can pair this with a cutting pad, like our orange hexologic cutting pad, or even if you have to go more aggressive with like our yellow cutting pad, we also have one of those as well. So this would be like a great combination to go with for heavy cutting on heavy imperfections, like scratches, swirls, and oxidation. And then finally, we have our Headlight Restore. Now, Headlight Restore is a hybrid grade product that does an incredible job at restoring yellowing headlights. So if you're looking for a product that's an all-in-one, I'm talking about clean, restore, shine, and protect, Headlight Restore is gonna be the perfect product for yourself. So if you have yellowing headlights, if it's flaky, if it's not looking its sharpest, this product's gonna do an incredible job because it restores the plastic lens very quickly, very easily, and it's not just for headlights. You can actually use it for taillights as well. So the beauty with Headlight Restore is that you can pair it with your favorite rotary or dual action polisher. You can do it by hand or by machine or even with a drill, and it's gonna work out incredible to just remove that yellowing layer of oxidized plastic on your headlight to restore the full clarity and shine and it has that built-in UV sealant in there. And it's also gonna help with the yellowing and preventing it, that way it doesn't get yellowed. And you can actually use this very often, so it's not just a one case scenario. You don't just use it once and then never use it again. You can actually use Headlight Restore as often as you like to just make sure that your headlights are spotless, they're fully clear, super clean clarity, and they're also protected with that durable UV protectant sealant that's built in within it. Within it. Wow, all right, within it. <laughs> All right guys, and that's gonna go ahead and conclude it for our compounds and polishes step-by-step -step guide. As you guys saw, we went from, actually we didn't go in this order, but we have our 
V-Line, which is a multi-step correction system, C4, P4, which is a two-step correction, and then last but not least, we have our VSS scratch and sore remover, which is a one-step correction. We went over our VO4 all-in-one polish and sealant. We went through our phase five fiberglass polish, and last but not least, headlight restore. That's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that this video kind of clears up your guys' questions on which one of these is really the perfect one for my ride, just because, like I mentioned, there's different scenarios, there's different vehicles, there's different makes, different models, there's different combinations that you can use a pad and machine. So it's really gonna vary as to which one of these is gonna be the perfect one for your vehicle. But I do definitely hope that this video does kind of clear up some of the maybe lingering questions you guys might have when it comes to our compounds and polishes. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give us a huge like. And if you guys haven't seen our previous video where we did a full breakdown on all of our torque polishers, make sure to go check it out. We'll link it in the description down below. As always, if you guys wanna pick up any of the products that you guys seen on today's video, you can pick them up all on our website, chemicalguys.com. And you can also swing by your local detail garage store and pick them up in person. As always, my name is Joey. This is Chemical Guys Detail Garage. We'll see you guys next time.